Are you looking for the best Nikon camera? In this video we will look at some of the 5 best Nikon camera on the market. Before we get started with our video. We have included links in the description. So make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Starting at number 1. Nikon Z50 Camera. Nikon abandoned its DXSLR line in favor of Z-mount mirrorless cameras. The 20.9MP Z50 is the most sensible entry point for photographers looking to get into the Z system without spending for a full-frame body. It supports 11 frames per second bursts, captures 4K 30 video, and betters the D5600, which it ostensibly replaces, with a wide spread of focus points. We also like that the Z50 has some dust and splash protection, which isn't common for entry-level models. Just keep in mind that you need to add a weather-protected lens to take full advantage. The Z50 is a little bit better than entry-level and should appeal to photographers with some know-how. And, if you're moving up from a Nikon SLR, you can bring your flashes and lenses, with an FTZ adapter, along with you. We like the Fuji X-T32 and Canon EOS R10 a bit better at this price for creators who don't already have camera gear, however. Light and compact. Big, crisp EVF. Speedy response. 11 frames per second continuous drive. Strong 4K video quality. Built-in flash. Compatible with Nikon SLR lenses via adapter. Number 2. Nikon Z5 Camera. The Z5 is the most affordable entry into Nikon's full-frame Z lineup. It's an important distinction because most Z lenses are for FX sensors. We like that Nikon doesn't skimp on features here, the Z5 has dual memory card slots, weather protection, a big EVF, and a 5-axis stabilized 24MP sensor. There are downsides, its focus tracking tops out at 4.5 frames per second, for example, so it can't keep up with many action subjects. If you are upgrading from a D750 or want to jump right in with full-frame photography, the Z5 is a suitable, value-centric choice. It delivers very good picture quality and autofocus performance, even though it's not the fastest camera on the block. It crops 4K30 to a DX view, however, so we encourage video specialists to step up to the Z62 instead. 24MP full-frame sensor. 5-axis IBIS. Tilting touch LCD. High magnification OLED EVF. Dust and splash protection. Dual UHS-2 card slots. Works with Nikon F lenses via adapter. Number 3. Nikon Z62 Camera. The Z62 is Nikon's second generation, mid level full frame camera. It matches the imaging performance of an FX sensor with the speed you expect from a fast action camera like the beloved Nikon D500 and throws in semi pro video features for good measure. The Z62 uses a 24MP sensor with 5-axis stabilization, can fire off raw photos at up to 12 frames per second with tracking, and records high-quality 4K60 video internally with support for 4K raw HDMI output, via a factory upgrade. Get the Z62 if you like the idea of a Z5, but want faster burst rates, better low-light image quality, and higher-end video specs. It has the same pixel count as the Z5 but uses newer BSI sensor tech for improved speed and imaging. Weather protection and dual card slots, one for high-speed CFE media, add appeal for creators who depend on burst capture to get the shot. 24MP full-frame image sensor. 5-axis in-body stabilization. Phase detection autofocus. Up to 14 frames per second continuous drive. Dual memory card slots. Strong 4K video toolkit. Number 4. Nikon Z72 Camera The Z72 mounts the D850's 45MP sensor on a 5-axis stabilizer in a mirrorless body, swapping the popular DSLR's optical viewfinder for an EVF in the process. The second-generation Z72 builds on the first with dual card slots, CFE and SDXC, 4K60 video support, and a refined focus system that can find subjects nearly at the edge of the frame. Landscape specialists, studio photographers, and portrait artists should appreciate the Z72's pixel count, dynamic range, and focus system. It's capable of capturing fast action too, with 10 frames per second continuous drive and subject tracking. Simply put, 
It's the natural upgrade for D810 and D850 owners who want better autofocus and more speed. If you want a camera that's even more capable for action in a slightly larger body, consider stepping up to the Z8. Superb 45MP Full Frame Sensor 5-axis IBIS 4K video at up to 60 frames per second Tilting Touch LCD Magnesium build with dust and splash protection Legacy lens support via FTZ adapter Snap bridge wireless Number 5 Nikon Coolpix P950 Camera Bridge cameras like the Nikon Coolpix P950 pair smartphone-sized image sensors with fixed SLR-sized lenses. Nikon currently sells two models, the P950 and P1000. We recommend the P950 more highly, its 83x zoom range, the full-frame equivalent of 24 to 2000 mm, captures wide views and goes in tight for wildlife close-ups. It's pretty reasonable to carry, though certainly bigger than 65x models like the Canon SX70HS. Buy the Colpix P950 if you want to zoom in for close-up shots from far away. It's a hefty camera, 2.2 pounds, but not as unwieldy as the 125X Nikon P1000, 3.1 pounds. We see the P1000 as a camera for edge case users and the P950 is a more approachable model for enthusiasts and hobbyists, extreme telephoto lenses require some skill to achieve optimal results. 83X Zoom Lens Strong Image Stabilization Manual controls Raw imaging and 4K video EVF and Variangle LCD Mic input and accessory shoe Wi-Fi and Bluetooth